Good morning. Uh, I'm very honored to speak here to address the important issue on place making based on public life uh, for the challenges of rapid urbanization in China's cities. The title is a little different from the uh, show on the poster. That's they give me, but this is my um, title. Uh, I'm a teacher and a researcher at Tongji uh, uh, University, Shanghai. Um, and in practice at the Shanghai Tongji Planning and Research Institute. My speech comprehends four parts. A general introduction to the background of the rapid um, uh, urbanization in China currently, um, and the challenges were faced up to three examples from my own practice and finally, I will summarize several strategies for public life-based placemaking. First, let's take a look at China's urbanization process. The figure shows us that over the past 60 years, the country's urban pop uh, population has increased more than seven-fold, uh, the blue columns. Open, urban population and the red one, rural uh, urbanization. Be careful, in two, 2011, in 2011, uh, the urban population in cities uh, has been over in urban areas. Let's look at if urbanization continues at the range of 1% annually, uh, exactly from, from 1995 till now, the average urbanization rate is 1.4% 1 uh, annual. If keep this trend, then an uh, estimated 900 million Chinese were living in cities by 2020. We can make a comparison. China, this, this table shows us the time length of the urbanization from 20% to 40%. China has improved the urbanization rate from 20% to 40% within 20 years which turned out to be two times faster than many other advanced countries. And with such rapid urbanization, cities have witnessed a dramatic urban scale, height, and speed. Here is the example of Shanghai. The number of high-rise buildings with a height over 100 meters is far more than 400 in Left is the view of Pudong, Shanghai Center, uh, currently under construction, will be the second, second highest in the world. And here, uh, in, ter in terms of the large scale in infrastructure, high speed rail system, the total length of China's high speed rail uh, in operation now has reached uh, 20,000 kilometers, and in the future, uh, it will amount to half of the total length uh, of the world. So the high-speed rail systems have facilitated uh, open growth in China. Rapid urbanization has accelerated the economic and social developments, as well as the living conditions of civilians. However, such rapid development may inevitably to potential problems. For example, the potential degradedness of public space and public life. Here are three cases. Uh, the capital of Beijing has the most heaviest traffic jam in the country because of the large open scale and vast construction. Traffic congestion has seriously affected the citizens' daily life. In Shanghai, large scale urban renewal leads to vanish of the traditional architectural 
and residential culture and the dissolve of social fabrics. Datong, an ancient city of Shanxi province, have torn down many old remains and built new fake instead. But, but it seems such magnificent building and the squares haven't met local residents' needs for comfortable public space. So what's the impact of rapid, rapid urbanization? It may imply large-scale consumption and it brings about intensive social, demographical, and environmental problems. Such in turn will have direct or indirect impact on urban life. For instance, newly built public space may lack human skill and be unsuitable for public life. A negative circular process may form among public space, public life, and urban prosperity. Uh, Chinese academic, uh, academics has reflected on these problems, and the findings can be drawn as following. First, pure pursuit of city image projects by local officials. Uh, it can also be, un uh, it's understandable, um, it's, it's a, because it's a common phenomenon in a global era. The deep reason is to, just to attract flowing capital and capture FDI or NII, national inward investment. So it's, uh, it's common, in, especially in developing countries. And it's, um, after all, it's a physics phenomenon. Cities need more time to be matured. And the, as we know, traditional Chinese cities never lack of public, uh, public life. Um, in the end, it may be failures of some design and plan. Meanwhile, there have been in endeavors in the field from researchers to practice. Here are some best practice in Shanghai. Tian uh, it's a layer and a tourism landmark, but it, it has kept the typical uh, Shanghai Linon life. Xin Tian Di and uh, Old Pyre, both are popular consumer and sightseeing spots for the mixture of traditional and modern elements and friendly human skill. And a big sum plaza, center of a high-end, high-rise residential district uh, in Pudong, uh, is vibrant and prosperous for its location, size, and atmosphere of space. And for my own thinking, the goal for better place making is to enhance the public life, to facilitate the city's prosperity, and how to achieve the goal. There are also two points, to recapture public life as an important planning dimension and to examine the interplay between public life and public space. The following, um, Three cases from my practice. One lies in Shanghai and the other two in Shandong province. All the cases have much to do with the theme of this conference, streets. The first, the ca first case. Uh, in this table, there are two, uh, the left columns are just the profiles of the case, and on the right, uh, the hints of case, just uh, some my special consideration in this project. So here, list the location, site, use, plot area, and the status. Uh, it's just uh, the hints for this project is just adjusted to local cultural tradition and match with surrounding environments and suit to diverse public life. Uh, Huangpu River divided the metropolis into two parts, Pudong, Pudong and Puxi area. Here is the bound. Zhenru uh, Tang is here. This is the surroundings. Zhenru Tang is famous for its uh, for Zhenru Temple. Uh, it's a hi historical religion re re relics. It's also a uh, relics, re, uh, religion relics used to be used now. The site is adjacent to Zhenru Temple. Here is, uh, is the site of Zhenru Temple, 
and uh, here is the resi uh, residential area. So it's a long uh, street strip. A new market street was developed here. The concept of the plan is to create a diverse public space for public life uh, in a street stripe. A series of uh, pocket uh, squares are set along the, along the, along the street, therefore people to, uh, can link there. And the inner, inner courts are set in this, this wider uh, side. Notes and notes and the landmarks can help to organize continuous streetscape and guide walking routes. An important concern is to keep the signed corridor to the temple, especially to the high pagoda. Left is the master plan, and the texture ana uh, uh, analysis show us um, the new building has a similar volumes and the texture with the, the old buildings, or the, the current buildings. And here is the figure and uh, fig ground relation and, uh, analysis. It can, uh, which shows the serial of, and the connectivity of public open space. Model on the left clearly shows the future space of the future street. And the pictures on the right uh, present the view of the street after its completion. The signed corridor uh, uh, to the pagoda is uh, deliberately kept. The new market street has pro proved to be a success uh, uh, as a consumer and the layer players in attracting local residents after its completion. <coughs> and case two is located in Zibo city, Shandong province. Zibo is the um, capital of ceramics uh, of China. And in this, in this case, sp special consideration adjusted, uh, adjusted to local cultural tradition match with surrounding environments. There's a topography in this site and the coexistence of new and old elements, including buildings, plantings, and waters, and respond uh, to old scale from material and spatial features, not just the uh, copy, the, uh, the old ones. The site is adjoining a well-preserved old uh, business street. The pink, the pink stripe, down from Ming and the Qing dynasty. The topograph is complex here, uh, even with uh, five meters. You know. This is the current st uh, streetscape on this, st uh, this uh, old main street. It has been uh, uh, become a tourist uh, site uh, and uh, even highlighted uh, in movie scenes. But people, the residents, live a peaceful life there. The remains around the site. And the old buildings are kept uh, on, on the sites, just as they con constitute the whole part of this space. And the temples. And the GIS method uh, is used to uh, analyze the complex topography and the multi, multi schemes for co comparison at the early stage. Three alternatives were offered to the local engines. They preferred this one. The garden type, okay. Uh, inner streets are created to increase to increase the consumer uh, flows and also the, to uh, create the vivid public space. Perspective view and street facets. 
view of the completed project, just look like what the perspective drawing is showing. And the view of the co completed project, of the old buildings reserved and the new ones. Case three, uh, in Tenzhou City, here, this, this title uh, is, a, is, a, is a name of a land which um, has a historical uh, allusion why are non relics left. So it's, it's, a story, it's just a st story is telling. So it's used as a, as a memorial and as method in place making here. Okay, coexistence of new and old tenements. And a street, not a road. Tenzo City, the general view. Rich, uh, rich for culture and art. Current situations, two-story roof, uh, flat roofs, stands. Okay, uh, according to the master plan, uh, broader uh, roads will be built. But according to our plan, we try to, uh, we put forward three uh, points. First, uh, keep the streets and the lands and uh, reserve the, the main blocks and uh, use the uh, multiple approaches of new built, re renovated and reserved to maintain the facades of the streets. Just a, yeah, just a, terrorist, uh, just a uh, storytelling with the four streets, cultural street, commercial street, and food street, uh, uh, residential street, six areas, 10 sound scene, must plan model, and here, at the entry and the in main intersection, nodes are created for attract the public life. Illustrations of some parts. Here, cultural street, intersection area, uh, food and restaurant street, and the illustration of renovation. So, at last, my <laughs> uh, strategies first. Uh, set comprehensive goals and common factors. Focus on such common factors and find creative solutions. Thank you. Thank you.